Leading a public life is better than leading a private life and it is the purpose of this video to investigate this claim. With the public life, all of your desires, wants, and dreams are publicly documented and your motivations are made clear. Living a public life, you can be authentic in your actions and never worry about going against the grain of yourself because you're the one who are guiding and directing yourself. By living a public life, problems in your life can be managed and rectified more easily. With the public life, you don't have any secrets, nothing to haunt you. If someone has a problem with any of your decisions, they can go back to the content that drove you to make those decisions to see your reasoning. Being public in your life is just more fun. I can share all of my experiences with the camera and not hold anything back. The public life makes it possible for you to develop strong friendships on the internet with people who care about you for who you are as a person. The public life is less superficial. I can be very direct with my audience. Every aspect of my life is before you. How much do you want to get to know me? Living the public life is a really honest way to live. Come talk to me personally in my Discord server. Search for the video called My Discord Server and come chat with me. I would love to see you over there. The public life reinforces the messages that you convey because your life backs up those messages. You are not disconnected from the person you see before you. All of my emotions, thoughts, and feelings are publicly displayed for you to analyze if you so wish. I'm not here just speaking about one aspect of life. I cover my whole life. My heart is an open book for you to read. I used to include my full name in my content. But I no longer do that because I was stalked for a while and it was really scary and I didn't like that so I stopped using my full name and now I just go by Wendell which I think was a beneficial contribution to my work because now I don't have to worry about stalkers so much because revealing your identity in its full aspect reveals people who might want to harm you and I didn't want any part of that so I just started going by Wendell which is my first name 
so I'm not lying. It doesn't matter if you know my full name or just Wendell. The content speaks for itself and my life is an open book. Sometimes I have to prioritize my safety over being a public person and to what extent I will be a public person and how people will be able to track me in my physical environment because I don't want that happening. If you could not try to track me down physically, that would be good. And please do like the video. It lets the AI algorithm know to suggest it to other people. So it would mean a lot to me if you liked the video. A full name doesn't mean anything. You have a face here and you have me going through my whole life on camera. So you have everything that you need to assess whether you want me in your life or not. Besides the stalking that I experienced, I haven't really experienced any other negative consequences for being public online. Sure, you get the occasional troll, but all in all, it doesn't really negatively affect me by putting my life on the internet. If this is so healthy, how come so few people do it? I want to live in the world where lots of people vlog their life. I want to spend my life being entertained by people and not mainstream media. Most of my life is just me trying to entertain myself with a camera. How many times can I press the record button? Living a public life gives you a sense of inner peace. Like Nothing can hurt you. Living a public life assures you that you are doing the right thing because all of your motivations are out in the open and if you ran into any problems, you could quickly identify and rectify them. Living a public life makes you feel good as a person because you know that you're doing everything that you can to help other people. With open hearts and open minds. Do tell me in the comments, would you be open to becoming a public person? Would that be scary for you if you're already a public person? How do you handle that on a day-to-day -day basis? Do you reveal everything in your life or do you only reveal parts of your life? Do tell me in the comments. I appreciate your attention span. Until next time, this is Wendell signing off.